Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Worship Gunner 2. In the last episode, we did uh, mission 650, and did we do two missions last time? I thought we might have done two missions last time. Whoops. Um, well, we might have. Anyways, today we have 660, which means we are going to be fighting the Helitash, which means I want to go with the Twin Hole Battleship, but we should take a look at some R&D here, because we have a lot of money that we're sitting on. So, let's go through here and just see... If there's anything that jumps out at me, no new aircraft. Oh. Hmm. Okay, there's Enigma Tech Gamma, which is not a bad one, but uh, it definitely has some other ones that are even better than it. Let's see, Bow Jet Thruster. Yeah, I definitely want that now. Um, that's gonna be important. Defenses eh, is still where we left off. Attack. I don't really need anything else in there. Engines. Um. Pretty sure, yeah, next fusion reactor is not ready yet. Although it could be. Or it's still not. Never mind. Alright. That, that makes me sad a little bit. Um, let's see. Everything else, I mean, we're pretty much caught up. That's the thing. I suppose we'll go ahead and get down here. Uh, because, why not? Um, but, yeah. Everything else, we're basically there. Even the high-tech category is all caught up. Which I've largely been ignoring so far. Yep, everything we care about in here and engines is all caught up. So, yeah. Alrighty. Well, in that case, I guess we'll just head back. And we need to upgrade the bow jet thruster on our battleship. And here we go. Let's see. Because <clears throat> we, uh, we have bow jet thruster 1 on there, but it wasn't quite cutting it. Uh, upgrade and systems. And there we go. Cool. And anything to change here? Yeah, we got a uh, better steam turbine. Now, how much did that really help us? Um, it did make us almost two knots faster, so that's good. And, uh, yeah, I don't think we have any weapons to upgrade. Pretty sure. Nope. Okay. All right, well, Twin Hill Battleship is ready to go. I'm ready to go. I hope you guys are, too, because we are going to go fight. Hell, attach, and we should be able to do this with relative ease, given the ludicrous, uh, uh you know, armament of this battleship. <clears throat> I'll say that you know, generally, I do prefer the uh, the 61 centimeter three barrel guns, but where these ones do have an advantage, one area where I prefer these is range, and that All is it's actually very important for this particular guy. Oh, yeah, I forgot about all the stupid ships that he has in front of him, too. I hate them. <laughs> They're the ones that make this really hard. I think about a powerful nose to head. Uh huh. It's a super weapon. That's no oil rig. Horrifying sight, super weapon, fortress on the water. Yeah. It's, uh, it's pretty crazy. Can't open a way to the capital unless we destroy it. All hands battle stations. Alright. We haven't even seen what it does yet, but we're like, man, we gotta kill that thing. And they're not wrong. Alright. Battleships, four days. Goodness, these guys are easy to kill with these guns. So yeah, oh yeah, these uh, the mirrors deploy. Ow. Come on, there we go. Treasure is a surface base that you need a helicopter to get. Something's happening in the upper areas of the fortress. Energy is collecting in the turret. Oh boy. direction. Oh boy. Yeah, see, this is hard to do without the forward thruster, but that's why we gotta be a little careful here. We need to kill these battleships. Flare, chaff, listen for it. It comes again in a second, at least. As soon as he's locked in, there we go. Hard turn. There we go. 
Get out of the way. Gotta kill some of these other ships here. There. Alright. Now I feel a little more comfortable focusing on him. Or at least on his supports or whatever I can hit, really. Um. Shells? Turn, 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 turn. Come on. Use the rudder. Well, well, I he did get us with that one. The uh, battle jets are just going to be a little finicky sometimes. Chaff. Why can't I seem to be, like, I'm not hitting anything. There we go. Oh, so you seem to one of the sort of supports. And uh, attached to them and we've been destroyed. Sweet. Yep. Yep. Turn. There you go. Alright, we're gonna have to stop shooting at him for a second to deal with all these guys. So like I said before, it's all of his escorting ships that make this so much more annoying. Chaff, flare. Turn. Turn. Other battleships at you, 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 you. He's getting ready to fire again. Get some more chaff and go. Turn again. Turn back. I'm gonna try to get back closer to him again so I can actually start hitting him. See, I don't understand why my shells just don't seem to be hitting a lot of the time here. Okay, time to put up some chaff and flares, because we are going to have to kill a lot of these enemy ships quickly, because they are hurting. That damage is starting to add up. Fire on deck. Just trying to manage, like... Um, trying to manage the enemy battleships without uh, letting myself get hit by the big laser. Let's do a, just an emergency repair to put a fire real quick. Oh yeah, turn again, turn again. Ow, come on. Die already, destroyer. There, okay. Oh yeah, we got rid of the uh, Aegis system and make room for some other important stuff. Turn. Man, that rudder does not like to work sometimes. There we go. I think it's probably my button on my controller. There. Come on. Come on. Do it again. There you go. Get more ships all around us now. See, I don't understand why my shells won't just get over there. I think there's there's too many particle effects going on and it's getting the game kind of confused. Wait for it. Turn. Turn. If I can just kill him, then we can go about killing the other ships and not have to worry about it anymore. Should be able to get him before he fires again. Yes. Alright. He's not, he's not that hard to kill, but, man, taking out his... Uh, his escorting ships and everything is the worst part. And one last hurrah for the Helitash. There we go. Man, oh man. Mission accomplished. Yeah, just barely. I mean, I guess we're doing okay on health. We weren't, like, in immediate danger of dying. But... Certainly closer than we've had in a while, especially for this battleship. I hate how much these guys are maneuvering. I can't kill them. Hold still, all of you. Chaff, chaff. What's those battleship at? You need to die. Oh my god, look how many more clusters of ships there are still. It's crazy. 
kill this guy. Where's the other destroyer at? Where is it? Lock on. Lock on. I can see it there. Thank you. <laughs> Don't tell me there's no sights in range. I can see it right in front of me. Flare, flare. Kill these guys and then repair. Either we haven't been given very, uh, very many repair kits, or I just haven't been paying attention enough to notice them. There's one. Look at that. Ask and he shall receive. Um, let's see. Flare. Oh, yeah, I gotta turn the engine on again. There we go. Chaff. And let's get the heck out of here. More chaff. Uh, Azrox. Okay. Yep. Sink all these submarines, hopefully. Turn, come on. I'm doing everything I can to get the uh, the, the bow jet thruster to respond, and sometimes it just doesn't want to. Chaff. Azrocks. More Azrocks, like this. More submarines just showed up out of nowhere. Alright, now we got more battleships and stuff. Yo, you're dead. You're almost dead. You. You. Chaff. Flare. Chaff again, just in case. Yeah. Deck damage again. That's fine. I think there's another battleship back here, actually, isn't there? Yeah, there you are. Nope. Nope. Yes. That one. And you. And that guy. Illumination flare. Shaft grenade. Ooh, that was good timing on the shaft. Missiles coming in still. More submarines underneath us. Turn! Oh my goodness. It, it just doesn't work sometimes. I mash the button like five times and it still won't go. Ugh. Um, let's see. Azrax again. Chaff. All of you, you, you. Where are these airfields at? Oh, they're carriers. That's right. We should just go deal with them real quick. Since we're finally done dealing with most of the big threats. Alright, um, we will refill our ramps. So those are probably getting low. There we go. Uh, let's see, carrier, where you at? No, not that plane, jeez. Look that way. There you go. Oh, that one's a transport. Hmm. Oh, they don't have an airfield over here, do they? I don't think they do. No, oh, there's the carrier. Come on, game, you are over the carrier. And then it flicked over to the land for some reason. Like, why? Why would you do that to me? Eh. Turn around. Did the carrier not die? How's the carrier still alive? Did we even hit it? Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> Get out of here. Got a repair kit. We're gonna go ahead and cheap out on repair kits here and use an emergency repair. And uh, we'll use some more repairs as we need them. Still going for that uh, Inferno mission unlock. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look. Another opportunity to use a repair kit. There we go. <laughs> uh, there's a submarine here. I need to deal with that. Fire off some chaff real quick. Chaff. Um, let's see. Funds. Oh, you know what? I didn't even go loot underneath um, Pelotash. All of his stuff is probably gone. Yeah, I can't see any crates underneath him anymore. Oopsies. Oh well. I get a little preoccupied with all the other things still trying to kill me. Ow! Seriously? Alright, submarines. You wanna play that game? Play that game. Where you at? Come here. You and your little friend, too. Alright. Uh, let's see. And then there's another one out in front of us over here. Enemy ship sunk. 
I think the enemy ships are finally done coming after us. Engine damage. Oh, really? That's new. Well, it's not totally new, but it's very rare that that happens. Wow. Okay, then. I wonder if that fixes itself. I'm just curious. Okay, Hellbridge fit does. We knew that. I don't know if the engine damage fix, uh, fixes itself. Boy, is this what it used to feel like playing the game? Put put around at 45 knots. <laughs> I love I love just saying that out loud and then thinking about how ridiculous it is uh, ridiculous it is to say putt putting around at 45 knots in a twin hull Yamato, but it's fine. Um, let's see. I guess we'll refill that. Are there more submarines around for me to kill? I don't think so. Not over here, at least. All right, I guess the engine damage does not fix itself, so we're gonna go with an emergency repair. Go for oh come on! Set me on fire right after I use the repair. Oh fine, we gotta put that out. We don't have much of a choice. Hopefully, our missiles that did launch will kill these guys. There. Chaff. Yep. Got the transport carriers over there somewhere. There you are. Go shells. Land on that carrier's head and destroy him. Flares. Uh, more chaff. Uh, that's a parts crate. He didn't drop any crates. Got, um, let's see. Where are the ships? Transport. And I don't know if they have another carrier outside of that. They might not. Man, oh man. Used a lot of repair kits, that's, uh, that's for sure. I keep trying to use the forward thruster that we don't have. Slow down, turn around, turn around, turn around. I swear that button just doesn't work. Okay, doesn't work sometimes. Most time it's okay, but sometimes it just it doesn't do anything. Ah, <sighs> all right. Let's go ahead and destroy all of these buildings here. Fire another flare just in case. I think we actually have all the ships now. Carriers, transports, and otherwise. <clears throat> go ahead and take out all these buildings, just to say, screw you, Empire. Batteries firing at us, yada yada. Let's see. Oh, parts crate. Give me that. Yeah. And we're gonna put up our helicopter here. Pretty sure we probably got this treasure the first time, but in case we didn't, we'll get it now. And in case we did, we'll just get one more parts crate. That's okay. What was that? That ex that explosion ended up being. Like, unusually loud for some reason. I assume just a couple of shells landed at, like, the same time or something like that. There we go. Um, I'm pretty certain everything is dead, so we're just going to go ahead and withdraw, and yeah, there we go. That's why I wanted to do that mission with the Twin Hole Battleship, because it would have been interesting to see if much other, maybe, maybe the supercarrier, but it would have been interesting to see, uh, you know, I don't, I don't think uh, most of our other ships would have taken that kind of a battering. But um, that's what makes the Twin Hole Battleship so good. It's, it takes some serious punishment. There we go. Uh, remaining repair bonus, zero. Good. <laughs> I like it that way. German Frigate 1, German Frigate 3, Ford Bridge Beta, okay. Battle Carrier 3, nice. Another Frigate, another Frigate. Outstanding Achievement Medal. Sweet. I don't know what that medal's for, but we got it. Going to go ahead and save over this guy. And done. All right, let's go see what's next. 670. Silence is golden. This would be the end of the first playthrough, but because we are moving into the second, Schwanberg at last. I hope he surrenders before the real fighting breaks out. <sighs> Incoming drone missile from Watermaker. Da, 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 da. I'm gonna go through this quickly. You guys can slow it down if you like. <laughs> and there we go. 
And this map that they only ever use once, which is cool. It does make it a little more unique and, and makes it um, makes it feel like, you know, if you saw this map, you'd be like, oh yeah, the final mission, which is good. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Target, only in a battle day. Okay, cool. Um, I We will look at R&D, but I don't think we're going to have much to do there. Railgun, yeah. Uh, let's see. Just quickly, I don't think more stuff will have come up yet. No. Um, there's a new launcher of some sort. What is it? It's a new rocket. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. The flamethrowers take a ridiculous amount of turns, even though they're not very expensive. I forgot about that. Um, no new aircraft still. Man, oh man. Steering, uh, badger thruster, obviously we just did that. Uh, defenses, nope, okay. Well, I guess we're pretty much caught up on the R&D we care about, so I guess that will do it for this episode of Warship Gunner 2. Thank you very much for watching, hope you've enjoyed, and as always, hope to see you all in the next one.